Sometimes the people say, Ibn Asirat al Mustaqima. People recite incorrectly, generally, because they don't know any better. A lot of people have learned how to recite from listening and not from learning. It's the same reason when people, when they're reading the Salah, they say, Allahu. And they don't say, Allahu Akbar. You know, not in, not in the Rukur, they shouldn't say, Allahu Akbar. But let's say any more, they say, Allahu Akbar. And they don't say anything else. You hear this a lot of times. Instead of saying, Allahu Akbar. They heard somebody, I asked a guy one time, I said, wait, man, what's... What you doing, man? Why you say Allahu Ek? Oh, I heard this. You don't, you don't make, that's the, the, the ugly taqlid. That's the blind following that is blameworthy. Taqlid that is not blameworthy is when you go to a teacher and he teaches you something. You don't necessarily know why he told you that, but you know, you, you're going through it like that. And this is your teacher, from your sheikh from your village or your hood. And so he's teaching you, you're going up. Then you say, okay, that's, you can take that. Somebody else come and tell you something. Well, you don't know him that well. So you're not going to leave that thing that you learned from someone who you do know. But just to look at somebody and follow them, and you don't know, is that person a scholar? Is that person a knowledgeable person that knows that thing? Should I take them? No, you ask. Ask the people who study, ask the people who know. Don't just follow them. So people make mistakes generally, all the time, because they don't know any better. Listen, we, we're not going to beat up any particular person, okay? But people make mistakes because they don't know better. And, what, and the more you know, see, it's all our fault. The more people that know Tajweed, then people can help and correct. When you, per, you, when you know someone's making a mistake, and you, you have to develop a relationship with that person. You know, because I don't care how much you know until I know how much you care. So if first you have to let me know that you care about me, and then I can say, okay, I trust you, right? But uh, we, this is New York. You know, people come up and say, yo, man, you wrong. You say, no, man, I ain't wrong. You wrong. What's the matter with you? And that's an argument as opposed to a conversation where we can get some benefit out of. So we have to be real adroit, real skillful in our approach to people because sadly, a lot of us got our, he our feelings on our show, on our arms. We, we're just really sensitive, super sensitive. And the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, let 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 don't be super sensitive. Let I'm sorry. You know, don't be so super sensitive. So we want to try to learn so that we can benefit our brothers. Uh, Sheikh, al Sheikh, Ibn Uthaymin, rahimahullah, he said the niya, if you want to perfect your intention, make your intention for talab ilm to raise up jahl, ignorance off myself and those around me. And that is a good and a clean, in, inshallah, niya. So let's make our niya to raise off ignorance from ourselves and from those around us. You wanted to say something? Okay, do I have any other questions? Did I answer your question, sir? Okay, okay. Okay, alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Aqulu qawli hadha wa astaghfirullah.